For many people, the most important Thanksgiving tradition is eating. And if you're like the majority of the human species, you have a hard time saying no to delicious food. The good news? Neuroscientists have started to figure out why. Overeating has been linked to a phenomenon called hedonic hunger. Hedonic hunger is the kind of hunger we feel when we need food for pleasure rather than sustenance. It's what's behind the powerful desire for food in the absence of any need for it, the point at which we eat even though our stomach is full. And since our stomach can expand to hold almost a gallon of food, that point is reached after a lot of eating. Homeostatic hunger, on the other hand, is driven by the body's need for fuel or to keep the body's biological system balanced, aka homeostasis. Most hunger is a combination of both. However, when you're reaching for that second helping of stuffing, even though you've had a full meal, it's probably because of hedonic hunger. What causes it is still unclear, but scientists have come up with several explanations, including emotional triggers, as well as the ready availability of delicious food during, say, a Thanksgiving feast with its many courses. In the 1950s, a French scientist named Jacques Le Magnin conducted a series of experiments on lab rats, feeding them different types of diets. When the rats were given one kind of food, they would stop eating when they were full. But when a few different foods were introduced, the rats would eat almost three times as much, sampling each new treat. This effect was rediscovered in 1981 by Barbara Rolls and her colleagues at Oxford, who called it sensory-specific satiety meaning that with one flavor, we quickly become full and bored with eating, whereas a new flavor stimulates renewed eating. This has also been called the smorgasbord or buffet effect, and Thanksgiving seems the perfect application. So when you're reaching for that extra slice of pie, remember that your desire for it comes not from hunger, from the need to sustain yourself with food. It comes from a far more complex impulse, one that we are still struggling to truly understand. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.